Many of you who follow my YouTube channel um, mostly know me for my Tacoma content and all the crazy little projects that I do with my Tacoma truck. But uh, what you should know is that I grew up with Jeeps. And uh, I said I'd never buy another Jeep um, until they started making trucks again. And guess what? They started making trucks again. So here I am. I got a 2021 Jeep Gladiator Rubicon as a new work truck. Um, and yeah, I'm planning on doing a flatbed for this too, so sit tight. And back to your regular programming. Oh look, that one's not my truck. Oh, shit, there's my truck. Someday I'll get rid of the ratcheting tie-down strap that's holding, holding my toolbox in place. Look, factory Rubicon, factory height. Look at that. I think he's a little taller than me. He must have like a, a little bit of a lift. He's got those um, little steps. Right, let's take a look. Huh. Yeah. He's got a, uh, a shitty built winch in there. And uh, I'm not sure about the bumper. XRC. I really don't know Jeep stuff, so I don't I don't remember any of that crap, but it looks like a interesting bumper. Um this is a brand new truck though, looks like. He's uh it's a sport model, so you can you it's really easy to tell the difference between the headlights uh right now. Here you go. That's perfect. Yeah. Well, I live in a small town and um and so to see another white jeep gladiator in my town um that's kind of cool and then oh look at that his muffler is uh his little resonator muffler there has been blacked out that's interesting i wonder if mine's blacked out yeah mine is too i just never noticed because i got this silly little thing on there but yeah Let's see, he's got a little sticker on. DSI Custom Vehicles. So this was probably purchased this way at the dealership. Uh, so he probably paid an extra eight grand for, what is that? Pro, pro comp wheels and tires and looks like a four wheel parts package. So uh, I know the dealership that I bought mine from had one similar to this it was white also um i doubt it's this one because it didn't have those uh rocker steps but um yeah it's a sport so the the interior package is a little different um and uh there are a few other differences as well but hey man looks good that's kind of kooky little town two white gladiators in the same town. Actually, there's another one. <laughs> uh, I, I actually like his black top. I, that's kind of one of the things I wanted um, on mine. But uh, I don't know. Maybe he'll trade me. It's, it's hard. I don't know which if I really like the black top or if I want to stick with the white top. I can't really tell. I kind of like the look of the black top, but then again, I'm a, a Star Wars nerd. And I uh, really like the uh, Stormtrooper stuff. And anybody who knows me and my Tacoma, it got busy right here as I'm walking around in the parking lot on a Sunday night. All of a sudden, kooky dukes. Um, yeah, I'm kind of a Star Wars nerd. And anybody who knows my Tacoma knows the license plate says Trooper on it. So the black top on the white body looks pretty bitching to me but i don't know the white looks pretty clean too so I, I, I don't know sooner or later i'll figure out what i'm gonna do with that and uh the custom plates are on their way and yeah so um my jeep got duck duck jeeped um 
I don't know, a week, two weeks ago, something like that, at the postal, uh, the post office. And then my daughter decided that she had to have all these ducks. So now I got a shit ton of them sitting there in my dash. And I think I'm gonna give this person one of those damn things just cause, um, yeah, but that's kooky. Two white gladiators, but he's got a little bit of a lift on his and a little bit bigger tires, so he's got 35s. I don't know if it's actually lifted or not. I really didn't pay that close attention, but um, if, if mine looks that high with 35s, then I think I'm gonna go with 36s. Ha ha ha.